Hello world and welcome back to Sevtech Ages of the Sky, where today we are going to be starting to create our first new farms. Let's build an island. We're going to build it out here. I think pretty much this area is going to be our tech area. And I know it's going to look ugly, but the only block we really have available to us at the moment is the Abyssalcraft cobblestone, which is a shame. So let's clear the inventory of all our gumph and make a large platform for ourselves. Now, another thing we're going to need, if we're going to do the farm over here, we're going to need dirt as well. So maybe I shouldn't fill this in entirely just to begin with. Let's do a bit of research into Steve Carts first. So I don't want to fly over the edge while I read this sort of stuff. Down here we had the Steve Cart stuff. Uh, the, assem the cart assembly will allow you to build a modular cart. Remember, you can craft upgrades and attach them via shift clicking to the outside of the assembler to speed up production time and other features. What's this part? Just the cart assembler. How do you make one of them? Cart assembler. Love it. What is this? You can't pull this out of there. Make a farm, do this stuff. Uh, maybe we just make a manual farm? Is there any other type of farming blocks? Like, do we have industrial four going yet? Or if I just type in farm. Farmland. Nothing there. About oh, auto. No. Uh, harvest? I'm just thinking of random words now. Okay, looks like we are going to have to do the Steve Cart's way. Cart assembly. I'm not even going to read into those yet. So, we need a clock. We can do that. Let's do thing one, one at a time. Alright, one, two, three, four of these. Ooh, one of these. And we're missing everything because I put them all in the chest. <laughs> That it? Right, Steve Cart's assembly. We've got the thing. What does the thing do? Who knows? What? To start making a cart, please add a cart hull of your choice to the hull slot. Okay, so what holes do we have? Bearing in mind we're making some sort of um, farm. A seed farm. Uh, makes motorboat fire resistant, increases its health. Okay. Um, so, I believe the better the hull, the more stuff we can do with it. I believe so. We definitely don't have any gold Gadorian. Do we have any... We can make a pig thing. Why Why is a pig machine? Memory of some Thunder Pig Arena. Ugh. Thanks everyone who donated during the 2013 Minecraft Marathon. Okay, reinforced hull. Reinforced metal, can we make this? How do you make reinforced metal? Someone tell me. Just tells us we're using this stabilized metal. Arc furnace. Okay, not using the reinforced hull then, are we? Ugh! Standard hull. That looks a bit simpler. Uh, so we need iron, iron wheel, it's just iron sticks. That looks a lot simpler. Let's do it that way. And can we sleep? Get this rain away. No, we can't. Lovely. A standard hull. That goes in here. And... Okay, so that unlocks all these different slots. Ready to assemble cart. Okay, so what's in the... Sheaves? Oof, and I've just been messaged. Hang on. What is this? Is that you, David? <laughs> in the chat, I've got a message from PayPal on my phone, but nothing's come up on my stream. Yes, it's just come up in chat. Wow, thank you so much. I've, you're, my first, you're my first ever donor. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. I've never had one before. I mean, you don't have to do that, but thank you so much, David. I really appreciate it, and I'm afraid I don't know why that didn't come up on my stream. That definitely should have come up on an alert. All right, what do we do here? I'm so confused. You've, you've got me in a fluster now. Pog, first donator. You are indeed. Thank you so much. I cannot appreciate it enough. Where were we? God. Oh, it's telling us to make a wooden hole. Okay. Let's make a wooden hole just for the achievement. Just to get the quest line going, hey? That'll give us two achievements. Now, we're not going to do anything with this, so let's just go... <gasps> no! No, 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 no! 
Oh my god! Oh my god! In what world is someone able to just yeet 48 iron ingots into the void? Damn it! You! Wooden cut! Why? Can we sleep now? God! Angry dreams! <laughs> I've never done something so silly before. All right, so Steve Carts, how does this work? Uh, cargo manager, liquid manager. Is there some sort of book for Steve Carts? Probably already have it if we do. Uh, better with mods, geology, totempedia, blood magic. Dang it. I have no idea. Doesn't look like there's a book. That's a bit silly. Alright, let's have... What, what's in here? So we've got engines. Let me look at engine. So we've got tiny coal engine, thermal engine, advanced thermal engine, coal engine. Well, we do actually have a coal engine, because that's what advanced us into age three. Now, if we've lost that, I'm going to be extremely annoyed as well. <laughs> Should be in here somewhere. There's a coal engine. Now, is there any more renewable engines? Thermal engine? Power the cart. Assemble with lava in its internal tank. We don't have a renewable source of lava. So that, what does this do? Won't occupy any space. Will hover. Will, however, conflict with tiny coal. Well, we're not using tiny coal. And this has 15 modular cost. So what does that mean? Uh, we, is, is that what the 50 means? So we have 50 total capacity. I think that's what it means. Okay, well, we've got the engine. And it looks like we can put multiple engines. So we have an engine up. Enable standard fuels. I don't know what that means. But that requires a whole lot of this gumph, which I'm not prepared to make right now. We're going to do something basic to begin with, not advanced. Uh, anything else? Is that it? Bosch, farmer, basic farmer. Oh. Is that too much capacity then? Is that not going to work? This is all new to me. We have attachments. I'm going to keep adding stuff. I know, I, I, I believe, you know, this is... Oh no, whole capacity. It's 200. What's this complexity cap? Okay, I don't know how complexity works, but never mind. Right, attachments. Oops, I brought up Twitch. Uh, top chest, Bosch. So we've got absolutely heck of a load of storage. Now, is there anything else we need, guys, that we know of for this farm? I don't think so. We can't. We could do the plant extender. I really do not know. The fertilizer? Mm, yeah, but no, actually, I don't think we could do the fertilizer, could we? Uh, no. Fertilizer. Can we do it? Yes, we can. We can. For that, we need the composter. Composter is some slats. Some slats is for mouldings. Let's get some mouldings up. Let's see. What were we waiting for? We were waiting for compost. Is that done? Oh, it looks like there's something there. Oh, I'm lagging. 16 fertilizer. Wonderful stuff. So that should give us what we need, yes? So if we smash that in there, okay, we got given a fertilizer. Is there any other tools? There was that plant extender. Oh no, that required the woodcutter, didn't it? Do we want to make it just in case? Planter range extender. Nah, I reckon if it requires a woodcutter, it requires a woodcutter. I think that's it. Any other add-ons? I know we looked through them already, but just in case. No, I think that'll be it. Looking at it, okay. Let's uh, assemble that. That's going to take, what, 50 minutes or something like that? 18. Few oh, do we have to power this? Ew. How's our coal? Oof, that, that didn't take long, did it? That really doesn't take long. Uh, okay, we're going to need more coal. 
gotta find more coal then. I was not expecting that. Right, guys, I'm an idiot. I reckon we should still make the Steve Cart's farm just for the sake of having it because we've gone this far already. But the garden close is the far better option. <laughs> I forgot that was even a thing. We can do this for the melons. How about that? For the seeds, we can make this, what, wheat, maybe? What gives us a high amount of seeds? What sort of seeds do we have? I think it actually gives us melon seeds from that thing itself. So we'll do it for our own food then. Let's do, let's do a potato farm. How about that? We'll do a Steve Kant's potato farm. And then we'll do a proper garden cloche farm. Which, which means we can actually fill that out properly. Because we don't need dirt falls for that. I can't believe I forgot something so simple. You could make a Steve Kant's farm for industrial hemp seeds and then use that for the oil for the biofuel. That's a good idea. Yeah, that would be better. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. That That's a much better idea. So let's do the garden cloche for the melons in order to make um, the ethanol. And then we'll use the Steve Cart's farm for the industrial hemp seeds. That's a much better idea because industrial hemp seeds... Ooh, that's something we need to check though. That's something we're going to have to test because obviously the industrial hemp seeds are a two-part system. When we harvest, is it going to harvest the top or all of it? It might not work. We will see, obviously. If it works, brilliant. We'll keep it that way. If it doesn't, oof. One, two, three. One, two, three. Right, we've got garden cloches. Right, now what we need from here. Want some melon seeds. One, two, three melon seeds. And then we also need some dirt. One, two, three. How do we want to layer this out, guys? Let's get let's get some like cheap crappy blocks and mark out what we want. That's what I'm thinking. If we get the engineer's book and the projection. Squeezer. So now what we can do is from the export, slick it straight into this side. And with the fermenter export straight into the inside that way we can then have out the middle why is there no words on that out the middle we can um we can have our biodiesel then what we can do is we can pipe that underground and have like a row of diesel generators here that's what i need next uh, oil processing? No. Power? Diesel gen? Diesel gens are massive. Uh, stop. So there's only inputs, and inputs are through the front. And what is the front? Front is the bit with the big knob at the front. Probably something like this. We're probably going to want one have it come up and then we're going to want a gap and if we have a gap see what we can have here now is if we have one pipe coming in from the center going underground have it under go underground have one pipe coming up here it will pipe into both at the same time now we're going to need to make a lot of stuff for this but that's okay and that's going to be our basic setup. I'm going to jiggery pokery things around a bit. Or we can probably bring the machine tighter together. But we want enough breathing room to like walk through it. Because it would be good to you know, have the pipe go underneath. That way we can still walk around. That way we can you know pipe up the back of it and stuff like that. Simple things like that. So then what we're going to need is the garden cloche. Now the garden cloche is we were going to put the melons in there. And that required the squeezer? Or was it the fermenter? Squeezer is seeds. Now we're doing the seeds with industrial hemp. So we want the fermenter. Okay, in which case, I'm probably going to switch these around again. But this is what we want. Oops. 
That's the power. Do we have to space them? I didn't think we had to space them. Uh, presently overheating and waiting for pa for pizza. Mmm, pizza. What pizza are you getting? Love a pizza. I think I'm going to put these sideways. No, I don't. I want to space them out. I just want to space them out. I need to put this in here. Right, this is where it's going to get confusing. I'm totally out of my depth with mods. No worries. Tropical bacon. Tropical? Is that the pineapple? Uh, bacon, mushroom, pineapple. Interesting choice. Pineapple on pizza is great. Don't even at me. I just don't like pineapple in general, so you can do what you want. <laughs> Now, I've just thought of a problem, though. We need water for this. And for water, effectively, we're going to need some water out of here, a massive place. For that, we're going to need another extractor. And the problem is we don't have enough power to power the first extractor. Oof. Solar. There is no solar power, unfortunately. Not with immersive engineering. See? Probably in the next later ages. As you can see, we're in different ages. We're in age three. And... Different ages give you different technologies. And we're just starting getting into electricity now. Um, I'm going to have to think of something different here. We might just have to mass... Mass water wheel it. I don't want to, but we might. The best way to do it is to just... Is to get the tank and a water sigil. Water sigil? That's from Blood Magic, isn't it? Water sigil. Infinite water, anyone? I assume you right click with this, it places a water source. That's what I'm guessing it is. Now we can make one of these. Water regent, sugar, two waters. Let's go for it. Let's, let's give it a try. Let's get ourselves one of these on the floor. Uh, our regent and our blank slate. And that's going to do some magic stuff. Lord, I'm so hungry and warm. I just want pizza. I'm the same. My belly is rumbling like hell. Bosh, water. Now, if I do that, it does kill me a little bit. I see. I've been playing more hardcore Minecraft lately. I did see you were online. I didn't have a chance to actually pop in. Um, but I did see you doing it a little bit a couple of days ago. Uh, okay, so we're going to want another area back here, aren't we? Bosh, there you go. Oops. Now, if I do this, it's going to look a bit funky. Because they've changed the checks textures. <laughs> Ooh, hiccups. That's not good. That'll be the basic premise. But now we need loads of those fluid pipes. How many of them do we have? Not a lot. We need another six plates then. So now if we... Again, move that. Can I put it one back? Yeah. Right, that'll be good. Now we need to fill this up. Really? Can I not just right-click it straight in? No, I can't. Really? Let me pick up this bucket. Well, that's going to be a bit of a pain. Um... God, that really kills you. No. It is, you have to power this, don't you? What if I do it like this? There you go. Just had it on the wrong level. Right, we need some more fluid pipes. Right, we, we'll also test the back test the back as well. We're going to need more pipes as it is. Right, let's test it this way. Okay, it is still getting water. You are, you are right then, um, David. But for sake of cleanliness, let's do it underneath. Right, there we go. So we've got our garden cloche now. 
they are starting to make melons for us and they'll make melons very quickly unfortunately that's not make how do we make that into melon pieces melons might not be good unless full melons can go into the fermenter because that's our next job let's make the fermenter also, we could just have these all next to each other because there's power on top. These are power supplies on the side, but we could just have them all next to each other. Oh well, I like it like this. Something we will need to do. We'll figure that out later. Let's make the fermenter. Heavy machinery fermenter. Let's take a picture of this. Hey, did it from memory. That's Streamlabs talking absolute gumph again. Right, where's our power supply? Right here. So we want another MV connector. Why do I have nausea, by the way? Interesting. LV, I want MV, there's MV. And one more MV coil. Why do I keep getting nausea? What's happening? Am I getting motion sick? Bosh, bosh. So you should now have power, which you do. Now this is where we're going to use some conveyor belts. I love conveyor belts, they're an amazing part of the game. Do I have any spares? Right, Bosch. I just picked everything up accidentally, there you go. Get off. There you go. Now this should be going in here. Okay, as we thought, it has to be the regular melon pieces, doesn't it? Yep. Right, we've got to switch that up then. Right, so we need the assembler. Let's get that then. Where was that? Simple machinery? Yes, the assembler. Right, let's take another picture of these. Fuck. I don't know, guys. <laughs> this is dumb. Is it because my hammer's mildly broken? That might be a thing. Ah, that might mean that you need to get into age 4 to actually be able to use the assembler. That seems stupid that it would let you build it. Ah, okay, further progression. Further progression, of course. Yeah, because we've already used this hammer on the other fermenter. Yeah, I reckon you're right, David. I reckon you're absolutely right. In which case, boo. I think you need to use potatoes in place of melons at the time being the upgrade to Melon Age 4. Ah, that's a better idea. Do I even have potatoes? The other problem is though, David, we still need a way of getting seeds. But that's what we were doing the Steve Cart stuff for. It all comes full circle. Awesome. Awesome. Now the potato system is good. Shall we make another area for the Steve Carts? In fact, the Steve Carts probably made now, isn't it? It's been a while. There we go. That looks tiny and weird, doesn't it? We need some other Steve Cart stuff now, don't we? I believe the cargo manager is what helps us place things down. Oh, we also need regular rails, don't we? There are Steve cart rails besides these two? How do you make regular rail? Tinker's rail. Don't think that'll be very good, though. Activate rail, 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 I think. Mechanical booster rail. Okay, interesting. So let's do what? Regular rail, which requires iron and oak. God, you came out of nowhere. 
that, this, one, two, three, four, and then it was these four with redstone. And that makes the manager. Something quick, is there any sort of like wrench or things so I can actually remove the Steve Cart stuff safely? Because I don't want it all just breaking apart on me. Maybe not. Let's just plop this down then. So, this is the cargo manager. Now, from what I have used before with this, you can set inputs and outputs. So, that's obviously the input. So, we're going to need a charge part for cart, currently rails, storage, torches, explosives, arrows, bridge, seeds, fertilizer. Oh, fertilizer is just bone meal. That's good. Fireworks, bucket, cakes, all slots. Okay, so what we're going to want in here is coal and seeds, isn't it? Um, then in we're also going to want what? We're going to want hemp. We're going to want hemp seeds in and out. Yeah, in and out. And then out here we're going to want the hemp fibres. Oh god, I'm confused. Let's make a track. Let's make a bit of a track. That's going to go in there, fill up, go around, dump in here. I'm, 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 I think this is it. No. Make that black. Now let's get a bit of coal. See if this works. Although there's, there's nothing to actually harvest yet, is there? So it's not going to work as of yet. And wow, 19 coal is all we actually have. Have we got anything else in here? No. Okay, we're going to need to go on a bit of a coal journey as well. Did I press F3? F1? Didn't mean to. I could set up a totem here quickly. Make this grow. Should we do that? Why not? It takes a bit of processing, but that's okay. Take the 12. Right, I want to try it somewhere at the end. Although that's technically the beginning, isn't it? Oh no, this is too random. Right, you're mature. You're mature. Do it at different points. That way we can test. Nice. I'm gonna head off. Thanks for the stream. No worries, David. I'm about to finish up myself anyway. I'm literally just testing this and then we're going. And are you meant to fill up now? No. What's gone wrong here? Do I have to turn it on with the lever? Right, let's try this. Right, so far you're not harvesting. Okay, that's really not working. I don't know guys. I'm gonna fiddle around with this though. Well guys, it's outro time again. And if you wanna know how this monstrosity behind me was created, then click that subscribe button down below. And if you made it to this far in the video, leave a like, it really helps me out. This series is being taken directly from my stream, so follow me on Twitch to watch it all unfold live. Link also down in the description. See you next time, guys.